combined with headlining comedy clubs nationally and his many corporate shows, Steve Heitner is one of America's best stand-ups and most recognized character actors. Here with more on his upcoming performance at Laugh-In Comedy Cafe, it's Steve Heitner. Good morning. Good morning, ladies. We are so excited to have you here. Nice and to be here. I had to spend a little bit of time with you this morning. I have been laughing all morning just being around you. Well, and it, you were so much fun. I did get a chance, uh, Ray the Trapper, with, uh, <laughs> yeah. with Spike. Yeah. Yeah. I, I actually found Spike a little smaller than I was anticipating, <laughs> so I wrestled Ray the Trapper to the ground. Oh, yeah. is that what you were doing <laughs> when yeah. I walked away? He gets very docile if you rub him right, right through here. Did you put the tape around his mouth? <laughs> I didn't need to. Oh, okay. <laughs> you flip him over, his brain just falls oh. right out. <laughs> Now, you are from New York. You don't see many gators in New York, no. now, do you? No. <laughs> reptiles. Pr planning to bring them back <laughs> home with you? Of a much different kind. <laughs> yeah. But was that uh, your first gator encounter? It was. It was. And uh, back there, he didn't have the tape on the map. Uh-oh. Yeah. <laughs> and you weren't afraid. You were yeah. like, let's go. Oh, no. I was, uh, I was it, petrified. It, it, <laughs> it's got some shark teeth. <laughs> I was petrified. <laughs> All I deal with is, is a child. <laughs> yeah. But he, and his teeth are sharp. <laughs> <laughs> well, you do have a son at home. And uh, we were just kind of chatting about your yeah. career during the break. He's 11 now. Um, he's schooling. How do we feel? How do, how do you guys feel about the whole uh, participation trophy? Every kid gets a trophy. I'm not, I don't, I'm not, I'm yeah, not nobody, cool with them. Nobody's I'm not good. The no, I, no, no. Nobody's good with that. <laughs> if my kid's a loser, I want him to know as soon as <laughs> yes. possible. Listen, that Bill's Get character. that job at GameStop and stay put, <laughs> mister. You're all done. I was cut from everything my freshman year of high school. Everything I tried out for, I was cut. Uh -huh. I mean, seriously, that is character building right there. Right. Yeah. It's so true. I, 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 I did the thing. I never got cut from anything. I didn't try out. <laughs> Oh, I was going to be like, walk. Yeah. So that's what I'm giving my son. He's on the keep the bar low. I like that. <laughs> well, what does your son think of your journey as an actor and comedian? Well, you know, I've been recognizable for his whole life. So as he was becoming more aware, he was like, oh, boy, everybody wants to seem to take a picture with daddy. So <laughs> at some point, I guess he was about five, he wanted to get involved. And somebody, of course, came up and said, oh, Steve, uh, we have big fans. Can we take a picture? And all of a sudden, Jack jumps in. He goes, uh, photo, no autograph. <laughs> No, 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 no. <laughs> do you do the selfies for fans these days? You know, autographs have kind of turned into taking a selfie. Yeah, nobody asks for it. Yeah. Most yeah. people don't ask for yeah. an autograph anymore. It's if all they you want know, the picture. It's all this. Yeah. Right. How right. do you feel about that? I feel fine. You know, I always feel like, as you two ladies, as attractive women, <laughs> it's like being an attractive woman. People come up if they're cool. <laughs> they're cool. If they're not, they're not. Right. So uh, I just kind of take it that way. If I'm if I'm uh, in a re if I'm in a bar or if I'm out socially, then I know it's fair game. Yeah. But if I'm sitting there eating dinner with my son and they're coming over. I know they're an idiot before yeah. they get there. <laughs> <laughs> well, what, you know, you're, you're known for, uh, you've got a long list. Uh, what aren't you known for? Yeah, there it's you really go. more like it because yeah, I've you've been, been in everything. I've been working a long, long time. Like, you know, Seinfeld is kind of an 800-pound gorilla. It just is. <laughs> right. You know, like in my stand-up, I wasn't talking about Seinfeld because mm -hmm. it was a while ago. But you know, sometimes one person says something and it finally gets through your head. Uh -huh. Like I was doing shows and they go, you hilarious, Al. you didn't talk about Seinfeld. <laughs> well, well, you know, it was a long time ago. I don't want to seem like I'm hanging on to something. And another show, you were hilarious. You didn't talk about Seinfeld. Yeah. Well, it was a long time ago. And this guy looks at me and goes, it was on today. <laughs> Three times, <laughs> it just is. It's just on. Is that what you say? Would that is that mostly what you get recognized for? Is your role in? Yeah, I mean, there's other shows I get recognized for as well, and I always get a kick out of those kind of recognitions. But like I said, you can't. The show's on three times a day, mm -hmm. every day, yeah. in the syndication and stuff. So I just embrace it. I was going to say, I'm glad you said that. We've talked to different actors. We've uh, mentioned Carlton uh, Alfonso, who played Carlton on right. Fresh Prince in the past. Uh, James Vander De uh, Vanderbeek from Dawson's sure, yep. Creek. We recently talked about that on the show because he doesn't like to be recognized for Dawson's Creek. Um, but like you said, I feel like... When it's especially such a big show like Seinfeld, you've got to yeah. embrace it, and right? And also, you, you you cannot embrace it, but you can't control it. Right. So it's it is yeah. what it's, it's going to be what it's going to be. Yeah. So I just choose to make it a positive instead of negative. Exactly. It's like Vanilla Ice, not wanting to sing Ice Ice Baby. Right. That's exactly. That's what people come to hear. Right. It's like that's very true because I used to say that when I didn't talk about Seinfeld in the show, it was like my buddy was like, it's like they went to see Aerosmith and you didn't play Dream On. <laughs> that's true. You know. <laughs> well, we're out of time here, but I want to mention real quick, Laughing Comedy Cafe. You got a performance tonight and tomorrow. Absolutely. Two tonight to tomorrow a laugh in comedy cafe or lick as i like to call it <laughs> come, come down to lick and laugh <laughs> lick and laugh there's that information on your screen make sure you check them out at laughingcomedycafe.com oh so great to have you on the show great to be here. Funny oh my guy. God. <laughs>